My name is Damian Williams, and I'm the United States Attorney here in the Southern District of New York. Today I'm announcing that my office has obtained a three-count indictment charging Senator Robert Menendez, his wife Nadine Menendez, and three New Jersey businessmen, while Hanna, Jose Uribe, and Fred Davies for bribery offenses. The investigation that led to these charges has been run. Senator Menendez and used his influence wrongly and see where he landed him into. Let's see what happened. And out of the Southern District of New York. The indictment alleges that between 2018 and 2022, Senator Menendez, the senior U.S. Senator from New Jersey and the chairman of the Senate Foreign Relations Committee and his wife, Nadine Menendez, engaged in a corrupt relationship with Hanna, Uribe, and Davies. The indictment alleges that through that relationship, the senator and his wife accepted hundreds of thousands of dollars of bribes in exchange for Senator Menendez using his power and influence to protect and to enrich those businessmen and to benefit the government of Egypt. The indictment alleges that Hanna, Uribe, and Davies provided bribes in the form of cash, gold, home mortgage payments, a low-show or a no-show job for Nadine Menendez, a Mercedes-Benz, and other things of value to the senator and his wife. Now, constituent sir As a senator, you, there are certain things you cannot do as a senator. Laws and regulation. Let's see what Senator Menendez did not do. Service is part of any legislator's job. Senator Menendez is no different. And as we explain in the indictment, there are things that Senator Menendez says he can do for his constituents and things that he says he cannot do for his constituents. He put it all on his Senate website. So for instance, it says he cannot compel an agency to act in someone's favor. It says he cannot influence matters involving a private business. It says he cannot get involved in criminal matters or cases, period. But we allege that behind the scenes, Senator Menendez was doing those things for certain people, the people who were bribing him and his wife. Now, let me say a little bit more about the conduct that's alleged in the indictment. The indictment alleges that Senator Menendez took several actions as part of this corrupt relationship. First, the indictment alleges that Senator Menendez used his power and influence, including his leadership role on the Senate Foreign Relations Committee, to benefit the government of Egypt in various ways. Among other actions, Senator Menendez allegedly provided sensitive, non-public U.S. government information to Egyptian officials and otherwise took steps to secretly aid the government of Egypt. We also allege that Senator Menendez improperly pressured a senior official at the U.S. Department of Agriculture to protect a lucrative monopoly that the government of Egypt had awarded to HANA, a lucrative monopoly that HANA then used to fund certain bribe payments. Second, the indictment alleges that Senator Menendez used his power and influence to try to disrupt a criminal investigation and prosecution undertaken by the New Jersey Attorney General's office related to an associate and a relative of Uribe. Third, the indictment alleges that Senator Menendez used his power and influence to try to disrupt a federal prosecution of Davies in the District of New Jersey in two ways. First, by seeking to install a United States attorney who he thought could be influenced with respect to Davies. And second, by trying to influence that office to act favorably in Davies' case. And as we allege in the indictment, the senator agreed to do these things and use his power in this way because Hanna was paying bribes. Because you're